All right, everybody. Miss Vintage said she wanted to video me, so I might end up handing this phone off, but how's that to start the video right there? Okay, two oh. guesses for what this is, huh? Anybody know? Anybody know? You, I don't, you don't know. It is, what is it? Hold on, wait for it, Vintage. What is it? Lake. Huh? Crater Lake. Crater Lake. And you're looking at a mini volcano within Crater Lake. A mini volcano within Crater Lake. And there's even one underneath water. And another in there. There's multiple volcanoes in there. So, so, um, we, this is day 80. We got in here last night and made it through a mini, our first mini rainstorm. And then today was our day to walk. I, I want to show you the north correction, the west rim. We're going to walk that entire rim all the way around there, all the way around there to that high bump there. And right about the low ground over there is where the trail then veers off and goes north. But uh, so that's all what you're looking at is the west. And then now I've got it, got you pointing north, really. And then, of course, around over there is the east. And we, we started back you down the trail about two miles. Um, so we, we, we have a little bit of an issue. You can see the haziness in the sky. They just closed the trail um, uh, north of us about about 10 miles north of us from here. They've closed the trail for about 40 miles because there's a fire right out where you're looking uh, about 30 miles from here. That's and that's the smoke you're seeing. It's encroaching upon the trail. So we are going to hike around to that closure point and then hopefully get a hitch and get around that today or tomorrow and, and get around the closure so that we get back on the trail. Uh, probably not tomorrow because that's going to be the, getting around it the next day at Shelter Cove, uh, about 40 miles of 40 miles up so let's see what uh, vintage wants to close this off or got anything to say for us a 21 year old discovered crater lake in 1853 1847 i think 1853 1847 one of the two yeah um, of course he didn't he wasn't the first to discover it but that's who's getting rid of the, the credit for the it, credit for it. So and was, there are fish in there and there are fish in the lake but they were stocked they were stocked and you can pay to go to that island out there, that volcano, and get on that boat down there and fish. See the little boat? Okay. And it's six hey. miles wide, right? Yep. 12,000 feet deep. Little boat down there. And the reason... No, 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 no. 2,000 feet deep. Really? I thought they said 12. No, no, 2,000. 12,000 feet is, is two and a half miles. Oh, that was the height of the mountain before it blew. Yeah. That's what it was. That's right. Okay. And do you know why it's so blue down there? Hold on. Why is it so blue? Vintage, why is it so blue down there? Because there are no creeks flowing into that lake, making it muddy. And blue light is not absorbed as well, so it's reflecting from the bottom. There you go. That's why it's blue. You have it from Ranger Vintage right sure. there. Sure. You wouldn't want me to be a Ranger. I've made two mistakes. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So for right now, we're getting ready to head on up there to the... To that area and do uh, an overlook from up there and then we'll um, maybe make another quick video for you to show you what the awesome sites that we're getting to look at today. Love y'all. Bye.